again. John, we've had a lot of reaction, heard a lot of things from around the country today about this case. Some are saying that because Alec Baldwin is a celebrity, that the DA could be overreaching here. What's your take on this? I know we're hearing a lot from around the country, not locally in New Mexico, but both coasts, for example, uh, legal experts saying, well, this is overcharging, Baldwin's not responsible. But I think we look at it through the eyes of the local district attorney. If she hadn't charged him, how would she continue on? How would she have another mm -hmm. case involving involuntary manslaughter? Because people would be saying, well, I'm not a celebrity, so mm -hmm. well, you know, I should be able to get away with this too. But mm -hmm. I think the fact is, is that she's trying to keep a precedent set here, which is that uh, if you use a gun, mm -hmm. if you're holding a gun, you're responsible for what comes out the other end. Mm -hmm. And you touched on this right here, but pretty much every accident's different. So this could set some type of precedent here in New Mexico? Well, I think the idea is that film sets are obviously have to be much more attentive mm -hmm. to, the, to the safety rules. And I think that's one point that, that the DA is making, is that there had been a lot of uh, laxity, a lot of carelessness, a lot of inattention to safety rules on this set. And that's one of the things that went into her charging decision. A lot of the staff coming and going, reports of target practice out there in the field. So, yeah, very different. Taking right, set safety seriously yeah. maybe the message sent here, too. Okay, John, thank you.